what's up everybody? It's Matt from Rocky's War Room. And tonight I have another Let's Build video for you. This time it's uh, for Beyond the Gates of Antares, the 28mm sci-fi miniatures game by Warlord Games. And in this pack we have the new New Who, <laughs> New Who Mandarin for uh, the Concord C3, Jai Galius. Uh, that's, it. that's how I've pronounced it. I may be wrong, but if I am, I apologize. Uh, but I call her Jai or J, one of the two. Um, <clears throat> really cool kit. Uh, it's a, a new ma a, a new new who character for the Concord that came in the Drone Scourge uh, Returns uh, supplement book, uh, and she's the one that actually is has has met the Virai and has, and has been her her ship was infiltrated and she you know if you read the story you'll get it. So she's the one that kind of made the first contact with the Virai. So let's open it up. Let's see what's inside. We got four bases and beyond the gates of Antares. There we go. And the sponge, keep the sponge. And we now have the models. So we got our four bases. We're gonna have to sand those down. And here are the two bodyguards. One of them needs an arm put on it, which is the computer, uh, not a computer, but uh, some sort of pad that they're looking at. And this one has a huge brain. I can't wait to paint that. It's going to be fun. And obviously the drone that goes with the new who right here. And Jai, Jai or Jay Gilius herself. She almost looks like an elf um, with her ears and stuff like that, the way that the model's designed right here. Um, she, she almost looks like an elf-like character, but uh, she's a new new human. She's super, super awesome. Uh, I love her character. Can't wait to paint this. So uh, what I'm going to do is I, I'm going to show you the tools I normally use to build these. I'll build it in its entirety, and I'll come back and show you guys what it looks like and tell you if I had any troubles. So I'll be back in a sec.
All right, there you have it. There's the New Who Mandarin, C3 New Who Mandarin, Jai Galius, as I'm, I uh, pronounce it. And there she is on the stand. Really awesome looking. Can't wait. Like I said, I can't wait to paint this. Uh, she had a little piece of flash right here. And a matter of fact, I don't think I got it all there. Let me see if I can get it from a different angle. I thought I did, but there we go. That's better. Uh, but all you really had to do is glue her to the base. There's no other real flash on her, which is great. Um, that's what I love about these models. The newer ones, anyway. <laughs> oh, forgot a piece of flash in the gun there. Look at me. Not getting in seeing it all. Try to go over these models a couple times, and sometimes you can't get all absolutely every one of them until you're in the middle of painting it. I know that's happened to a lot of people. You're in the middle of painting. It's like, oh, there's a piece of flash I missed. So I got it there. There's really virtually no mold lines. Um, hardly any flash on them at all whatsoever. Just cool looking. And uh, it wasn't that hard putting this arm on. Uh, it was really easy. There was a nice slot uh, to stick it in a, in a particular way um, in the arm itself which is cool. And the only thing I had any kind of problem with was the uh, spotter drone, um, or the drone the, that goes with the new who. Um, this back piece right here glues onto the back of this top piece, or this uh, front piece right here on top. And let me just focus on that for a second. So it, you can see where this little round piece supposed to go around. Now this piece right here had a piece of flash where the hole was. So when I started putting it together, I noticed it wasn't going tight. And then when um, I test fit it, well, I didn't test fit. I went through it again. I go, oh man, there's a piece of flash. So there's a little piece of flash on this side. I cut it off and uh, it fits snug. So um, that was the only issue I had with the whole thing, uh, which is really nothing. So anyway, Looks like, there we go. Um, just a little bit of an adjustment. Got it, okay. So it's an awesome looking spotter drone. I actually really like this spotter drone um, that the new Who's have. Or not spotter drone, but just drone and buddy drone. Uh, let me focus in. Buddy drone that it comes with. So uh, there we are. There they are. That's that, that's it. That's a whole kit. Thanks for sticking with me. I really appreciate it. Uh, this is immediately going onto my painting table. We're going to get her done and finished. So I uh, hope you uh, hope you enjoyed this. Uh, if you haven't subscribed, please do. Please tell a friend. Please spread the word. I'd really appreciate it. Uh, leave me some comments. Like this video and hit that bell so you don't miss any from me. And last but not least, from me to you. Ta-ta! And I'll catch you in my next video.